Welcome to my passion travel channel and I invite you I make content on tourism and subscribe to my channel and put a little like. Smoked salmon, Norway is renowned for its high quality salmon and you can find delicious smoked salmon served on open faced sandwiches called smorbrod. It's usually garnished with dill, lemon, and creamy sauces. Smoked salmon is a popular and delicious street food in Norway. Norwegian salmon is renowned worldwide for its exceptional quality and flavor. Here's some more information about this delectable treat. Smoked salmon, known as rocked lox in Norwegian, is prepared by curing fresh salmon fillets with salt and sometimes sugar. The fillets are then cold smoked using a traditional smoking process, often using beech wood or alder wood. This method imparts a distinct smoky flavor and helps preserve the fish. In Norway, you can find smoked salmon served in various ways as a street food. One common presentation is on open-faced sandwiches known as smorbrod. The smoked salmon is typically placed on a slice of buttered bread or a thin potato pancake called lefts. It's then garnished with fresh dill, lemon wedges, and sometimes accompanied by creamy sauces like sour cream or mustard dill sauce. Another popular way to enjoy smoked salmon is in wraps or rolls. Soft tortillas or thin crepes are filled with slices of smoked salmon, along with ingredients like cream cheese, cucumber, lettuce, and red onion. These handheld treats are perfect for on-the-go snacking. Smoked salmon is loved for its delicate, buttery texture and rich, smoky flavor. It's a versatile ingredient that can be used in salads, pasta dishes, or simply enjoyed on its own. Whether you're exploring the streets of Oslo, Bergen, or any coastal town in Norway, you're likely to find various street vendors and food stalls offering mouth-watering smoked salmon options. When visiting Norway, be sure to try this iconic street food and experience the delicious taste of Norwegian smoked salmon for yourself. Pulse, Pulse, or Norwegian hot dogs are a popular street food choice. They are typically served on a bun and topped with crispy onions, mustard, ketchup, and other condiments. Pulse is a beloved street food in Norway and can be considered a national staple. It refers to Norwegian-style hot dogs or sausages that are often enjoyed as a quick and tasty snack. Here's more information about pulse. Pulse typically consists of a sausage made from a mixture of pork, beef, or a combination of meats. The sausages are usually seasoned with spices like pepper, nutmeg, and allspice to give them a distinct flavor. They are then grilled or boiled until cooked through. When it comes to serving pulse, there are a variety of ways to enjoy them. One popular method is to serve them on a bun, similar to a traditional hot dog. The sausage is placed in a long, soft bun, and various condiments and toppings are added to enhance the flavor. Common toppings include crispy fried onions, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, pickles, and remoulade, a creamy sauce with a tangy flavor. Pulse stands and food trucks can be found throughout Norway, especially in urban areas and at festivals. These vendors often offer a range of options, allowing you to customize your pulse with your preferred toppings and condiments. In addition to the classic pulse, you may also come across regional variations. For example, in the city of Tromso, you can find a specialty called Tromso Pulse, which is a hot dog wrapped in a tortilla and served with creamy sauces and toppings. Pulse is a convenient and tasty street food that can be enjoyed on the go or as a quick snack. It's a popular choice among locals and visitors alike, and trying Pulse is a must if you want to experience a quintessential Norwegian street food. Farakal, while not typically a street food, farakal is Norway's national dish and worth mentioning. It's a hearty stew made with lamb, cabbage, whole black peppercorns, and a touch of water. It's slow-cooked to perfection and served with potatoes. 
Farakol is not typically considered a street food in Norway, as it is more commonly associated with home-cooked meals and traditional gatherings. However, it is worth mentioning as it holds a special place in Norwegian cuisine as the national dish. Farakol is a delicious and hearty lamb and cabbage stew that is traditionally prepared during the autumn months. Here's more information about farakal. Farakal translates to sheep and cabbage in English, highlighting its simple yet flavorful ingredients. The dish is made by layering pieces of bone-in lamb meat and cabbage in a pot. The meat used is usually from older sheep, as it contributes to the distinct flavor and tenderness of the dish. Salt whole black peppercorns, and water are added, and then the stew is slow-cooked for several hours until the meat is tender and the flavors have melded together. The result is a comforting and flavorful stew with tender lamb meat and soft, cooked cabbage. Farakal is typically served with boiled potatoes, and the combination of the meat, cabbage, and potatoes creates a hearty and satisfying meal. Farakal has a long-standing tradition in Norwegian culture and is often enjoyed during festive occasions, family gatherings, and autumn celebrations. It showcases the simplicity and reliance on local ingredients that are characteristic of Norwegian cuisine, while you may not find farakal as a street food option. You might come across it in traditional Norwegian restaurants or during special events and festivals. If you have the opportunity to try farakal, it provides an authentic taste of Norwegian culinary heritage and is a true delight for meat and cabbage lovers. Brunost Brunost, or brown cheese, is a Norwegian specialty made from cow's milk. It has a caramel-like flavor and a distinctive brown color. You can find it served on bread or waffles. Brunost, also known as brown cheese, is a unique and iconic Norwegian cheese that holds a special place in Norwegian cuisine. While it is not typically considered a street food, it is widely enjoyed and worth mentioning. Here's more information about brunost. Brunost is made from cow's milk and has a distinct brown color and caramel-like flavor. It is created by slowly simmering a mixture of whey, milk, and cream until the sugars in the milk caramelize, giving the cheese its characteristic color and taste. The process gives brunost a sweet and slightly tangy flavor with hints of caramel and a smooth, creamy texture. Brunost is often enjoyed on bread or crisp bread and can be served as a part of a breakfast or snack. It pairs well with sweet condiments like jam, honey, or fresh fruits. It can also be melted and used as a spread or topping for waffles, pancakes, or Norwegian lefts, potato flatbread, da. There are different varieties of brunost available, each with its own unique taste and texture. The most common types include Gudbrand Solsost, which has a slightly tangy and sweet flavor, and Gytost, made from goat's milk, which has a stronger, more robust taste. While you may not find Brunost specifically sold as a street food, you can often find it in grocery stores, markets, or specialty cheese shops throughout Norway. It is a beloved and integral part of Norwegian cuisine and culture if you're a cheese lover or want to experience a distinct Norwegian flavor. Trying Brunost is highly recommended. It offers a unique and delicious taste that represents the rich culinary heritage of Norway. Sveal, Sveal is a thick, fluffy pancake similar to American pancakes. They are typically served with butter and jam or sometimes with brunost. Sveal is a traditional Norwegian pancake that is enjoyed as a popular snack or dessert. It is similar to American pancakes but has its own unique characteristics. Here's more information about sveal. Sveal batter is made from ingredients such as flour, eggs, sugar, buttermilk, and a leavening agent like baking powder. The batter is mixed until smooth and then cooked on a hot griddle or frying pan. Sveal pancakes are typically thick and fluffy with a slightly sweet flavor. These pancakes are often served as a snack or dessert and are enjoyed with various toppings.
The most common way to enjoy sveal is by spreading butter and strawberry or raspberry jam on top. The combination of the soft, fluffy pancake with the creamy butter and sweet jam creates a delicious and comforting treat. Sveal can also be served with other toppings such as powdered sugar, cinnamon, whipped cream, or fresh berries. Some variations may even incorporate ingredients like chocolate chips or nuts for added texture and flavor. While sveal is not specifically associated with street food culture, you can find them at food stalls, markets, and festivals throughout Norway. They are especially popular during summer events and outdoor gatherings. If you have the chance to try sveal, it's a delightful way to experience a traditional Norwegian pancake and indulge in a sweet treat. Whether you enjoy them as a snack on the go or as a dessert after a meal, sveal is sure to satisfy your cravings for a fluffy and flavorful pancake.